A lot of teachers have asked me about zip files. Let me explain what you need to know about zip files. If you're working on a project that, mul that has multiple files, in this case I have four files, and I want to send these four files to someone, I could do four attachments and send them, or I could take these files and zip them. This places all of the files inside of one file, so then I simply have to attach one file. In addition to having multiple files inside this package, all of the files get compressed. So the overall size of a compressed uh, of a zip file is typically smaller than the size of the individual components. On the flip side, let's say you receive a zip file. Before you can use it, you have to unzip it. It's very simple to do. You find the file on your hard drive, you right click on it and select extract all. This takes the zip file and turns it back into the individual files that were inside the zip file. So think of a zip file as a moving truck. All of the files get you know, carefully stacked inside of there for easy transport. But once it arrives at the destination, you have to extract everything so that you can use it again.